must be planning uh, and get the research institutions, the universities, you know. I'm very popular, but it's very, I'm very, mm. sometimes I feel mm. like crying, you know. The university science and technology, you know, when I was minister, we went to the chemical engineering department in, in KN University, interacted with the professor, Dr. Ryan Ares, and, and some people there. And then we set up a program to produce hydraulic oil from a local plant. Okay. We gave them wow. some money, and we they, they did a, pro, they did a, a sample. sample. Mm. But then, scaling it up, that's, a, that's where the problem is. But uh, even to continue to get other products. So, the people are there. And sometimes people say that, oh, the investors are there, they have products on the shelves. And mm. No! Mm. Mm. They have done a lot. If you go to CSIR, the tech institutes, if you go to Atomic Energy, you, 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 you marvel the biotechnology and agricultural research institute of, of uh, uh, Atomic Energy. You know, they have technologies to produce good material for plantain, cassava, pineapple, and so on. In fact, when Ghana was, was cultivating the MD2 variety of pineapple, mm. atomic energy had mm. a way of, you know, giving us planting material. So there are a lot of things going on there, but then you have to look for them. Yeah. And let me tell you one thing. Yeah. Talking to these scientists, mm -hmm. atomic energy will tell you that no head of state, president, has ever stepped foot there. Atomic energy? Yes. That's amazing. It's just around the corner here. It's around the corner. No president. Of course, uh, Vice President Baumia was there. Uh, but I was there with him. Right. You know. But then, Nkrumah cut the sword for the construction. And then it was uh, stopped. Mm -hmm. And the champion yeah. restarted it and so on. Yeah. But since then, yeah. Nkrumah, did, uh, there was nothing to go, go there for, to, to look for. Mm. So, no head of state. So, sometimes they get discouraged. That's right. And there's so much that they can do. Mm. And therefore, we should not forget about the universities, the research institutions, the academia, academy of arts and science, and so on. They're all there to help develop this nation on the path of science, technology, and innovation. We cannot develop this nation, bridge the technology gap, ignoring the universities. Why are we spending so much money hmm. maintaining these institutions? <laughs> that is my point.